Hey there, I'm Lee Ullman here with some big news from the National Young Farmers Coalition. We're partnering with Heritage Radio Network on a special season of The Farm Report. It's all about what's happening with the Farm Bill and how it impacts farmers and eaters. I am growing diversified vegetables on land that's been in our family for 150 years. And so with the pandemic, gentrification, property values going up, we had to sell the land and we lost it. Join us as we uncover the untold stories behind this massive piece of legislation that shapes how we grow our food, what we eat, and so much more. The problems we have had, those are things that come from earlier Farm Bill and USDA policy, right? Like Earl Butts, get big or get out. You know, it's my responsibility to know not only what I'm eating, but then like how, how that all came to be and realize like, wow, like this piece of legislation, all this money, like it's technically something that I support as a taxpayer. While Congress debates the next Farm Bill, this is not just an invitation to listen. It's a call to action. Be part of the conversation. Subscribe to the Farm Report on Heritage Radio Network wherever you listen to podcasts. Hello, Mr. and Mrs. America. From border to border, coast to coast, and all the ships at sea. Streaming live from the County of Kings, Brooklyn, New York City, on the Heritage Radio Network. Are you ready for the fastest half hour on the internet today? It's the Mike and Judy Show. Spanning the globe for high-minded hijinks and low-brow kicks to bring you the best in sex, drugs, rock and roll, and nuclear fission. They're too bad for radio and too good looking for television. And now, here they are. To pluck the low-hanging fruit of the literati, your hosts, Mike Edison and Judy McGuire. Well, welcome to our music spectacular. It, it's going to be a cavalcade of stars. A cavalcade of stars that we were lucky enough to meet and watch perform music in our beautiful, sumptuous Heritage Radio Network studios. Right here on the Mike and Judy Show. But you know what, Judy? Nobody more special than our own in-house talent... Judy McGuire. Judy McGuire. Oh, I can't and wait for this. This is, this is the best. <laughs> Jack, you got that queued up? Cause, uh, I sure do. Uh, this, this is I've the best. I've been listening oh. to this on loop before we started broadcasting. <laughs> we, we've got such, uh, such, such an array of stars coming up, but really, where else could we possibly start than with the fabulous Ms. McGuire? Couple... I would feign modesty, but it's really not No, no my faux stuff. humility doesn't suit you. Jack, roll the tape. <laughs> I believe the children are future. Teach them well and let them lead the way. That's absolutely... I'm sorry to be so intimidating professional musicians in the room. <laughs> oh, that was good. So Whitney Houston, what was her deal? She died or something? Yeah, she, she <laughs> croaked from having too many pills and booze and, and dying in a bathtub, which sounds like an eerie warning for someone that I know whose name I won't mention. Hmm. You know... What's the, what happens in Seattle stays in Seattle. Was that in Seattle? <laughs> it was in Seattle in my boutique uh, Japanese hotel with the giant. Ba- you know, then they shouldn't give me volumes and they shouldn't put that much sake in the minibar. That's all I'm saying, okay? I'm just, just saying. Seattle has been responsible for the loss of many of our favorite rock stars, as you know from my book, the official book of sex, drugs, and rock and roll list. And it is fantastic. Thank you, Mike. It is, and I can't wait uh, for the party. Who's playing your party, speaking of wonderful musicians? Well... Not. Mm. <laughs> I never get to perform on the show. You've sang on the show more times than, than I, I have. And okay, for, I'm, I'm, for margin- my... I'm marginally a professional nightclub singer. We'll, we'll have you. <laughs> we'll have you sing soon. But first, I think we have a very special guest. Speaking of dead rock stars. Uh, We've Jeff got Buckley. Jeff Buckley, and uh, we were lucky to have our friend Gary Lucas on playing the guitar. And uh, Gary was uh, Jeff's um, co-conspirator. And one of the most player. charming guests we've ever had on. Yeah, and one of the best guitar players uh, I've ever seen, uh, let alone get fortunate enough to play with occasionally. So let's uh, roll back the tape and listen to Gary playing Grace.
That was beautiful. That was that was, that was fucking incredible. Um, now. From from the, the almost sacred to the definitely profane. Next up are your favorite girls, Kudzu and the Faggots. I love these girls so much. I was so happy they were co- they would come here and they weren't going to play. And then we we were able to talk them into <laughs> doing an acapella number called 14 Carat Abortion." Bum bum bum. I love another A B O R T I O N. Vacuum out my pussy today. Sit back and relax now. You might think I'm crazy, but I. I was gonna have a filthy Mexican's baby. No me gusta. I'm white upper class and daddy kick my ass. And Lois gave me 50 pesos and money for gas. It took a half an hour and a little cash. And the nurse was just about to throw it in the trash. No, I told her. Wait a sec, I got a better plan. And I headed to my jewelry with my fetus in hand. But I had a little bugger dipped in gold. A 14 carat fetus. It's a sight to behold. Put it on my bracelet as my brand new charm. I was wearing my abortion at the end of my arm. Some fucking Baptists might think it's a sin that I like to shake my wrist and say, what could have been? We're all drunk, but now it's time to go. Nothing's we're going to do. Our our motherfucking Mike and Judy. Shock Mike and Judy show. It changes every time. Yeah, we prep the end. We prep the end. You know what I love the Kudzo girls so much? It's because they're from Queens. Like enough of this Brooklyn bullshit already, right? Queens. You love them because they're cute. They are, and they talk dirty. They're very dirty. Speaking girls. of which, next up. Oh my god. Okay, as you know, Christmas music is good for me any time of year. Many things we disagree on. <laughs> You're Jewish. It's not your holiday. <laughs> and so is Princess Superstar. I know. But she <laughs> she did one of my favorite Christmas songs of all time. It it would be in the top five Judy Christmas songs. And here she is doing her Christmas hit. Live in studio, which was amazing. That was, that was a great day. I liked our Christmas party. That, that was, was good. That was really fun. And it turned one little Jewish boy, left him wishing he was Christian so he could <laughs> enjoy the holiday, didn't it, Mike? I'm still waiting for my Messiah. Meanwhile, here's Princess Superstar doing ready? Christmas ready, swagger. Ready, ready. All right, kick up the beat. Woo! Hooray! Yeah. It's Christmas! Yeah. I love Christmas! <laughs> <laughs> I love it when it snows. I love ho ho hoes, hot cocoa, not King Cole. Happy people throw them bows. I like parades. I like charades. Pumpkin pie on paper plates. Black guys and little girls in fresh dumb braids. I love Christmas. I love Santa. I love you, baby, and your Christmas swagger. Kissing you on tippy toe Where did all my lipstick go? It's Christmas, yo I love beaded sweaters Red and green tinfoil letters Cheerful sweaters Being together Justin Bieber What? I love jingle bells Christmas sales Chipping dales with Santa hats On the big cock Tails I love Christmas, I love Santa, I love you baby, and your Christmas swagger, I love mistletoe, kissing you on tippy toe, where did all my lipstick go, it's Christmas yo. For December 2 5, I'm too live, ever into my 5 5 frame, more caboose than a toy train. Damn, that granny got game. Hey, my good friend Keenan. Man, saw a dude hit me back when it did then. Getting ready for the weekend. Spending so much dough with Dwayne Reed. Tits the season. <laughs> I love Christmas. I love Santa. I love you, baby. And your Christmas swagger. I love mistletoe. Kissing you on tippy toe. And it all my lips. They go, it's Christmas, yo. I love Christmas. I love Santa. Everybody, I love you, baby. And your Christmas swagger. I love Christmas. And I love you. I love Christmas. Everything except the mostly Jew. Yeah, yeah, Princess Yay, Superstar. Yay, Christmas. <laughs> What'd you get me, Mike? 
Because every time you hear Christmas music, you have to give Judy a present. This Christmas is coming earlier and earlier this year. It's always Christmas. Hey, Jack, play the, play the Whitney Houston thing again. Yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been I've been waiting for you to say this the whole show. <laughs> just, just, just play it again. Can you give me that? We were playing with it before, and uh, he knocked her voice down yeah, an octave. And, um, yeah, let's do that. And uh, pump up the reverb a little bit. We'll turn her into a uh, tenor baritone. It's good. It's, it's her inner drag queen coming out. I believe right, the children <laughs> are future. How do you like that? I love that so much. I, I, <laughs> Oh man! I hate really. that. I don't have any sense of humor about myself. I think every time we play it, we should pitch it down just a bit more and see yeah, okay. how low we can I go. Like Grover. Right. That's awesome. You have a beautiful instrument. <laughs> Like I said, the faux humility doesn't suit you well, McGuire. It really doesn't. I'm trying hard to. I think one of the best days we had was when we played the newlywed game. Oh, because you got you got Ms. Martinez quite drunk before (laughs) you were plying those people with booze like crazy well just like all good reality shows that's true it was it was i wish we had cameras they were so funny and the best part was that christina and john who've been together for like 50 million years lost to a couple who broke up 10 years ago (laughs) they lost the newlywed game um yeah we should really go back and we should do that again play the newlywed game again yeah i miss playing mad libs too we don't play enough games on this show oh yeah we need to get that Shukert back in here. Meanwhile, Boss Hog came down and played the Newlywood game, and um, we can go back, listen to the whole show, and find out that if uh, Christina Martinez were a dog, what breed she would be, and, <laughs> and how many times John Spencer has made love to her. Maybe that's too much information. I think the answer was six and a half. Oh, I think it was less than that. And also, he didn't remember that they did it in a cab, which seems crazy. It's all here on the Mike and Judy show. We go there. <laughs> all right, here's Boss Hog doing I Dig You. Feeling not drunk but drowned, tough. Knock my teeth out, uh. make a way for the gold. Uh. Oh, that's, that's my guarantee. My, uh. my love, my word, uh. baby. Uh, I dig uh, you. The street there Eat raw macaroni Get down in a minute Come on now girl You got to show me If you want me to Anything I would Solid gold guarantee I dig your groovy hips. I dig your barbecue lips. I dig your much and more. Baby, and I want you to know that I love you. Yeah, I love you too. Oh, yeah, happy Valentine's Day, everybody. Come on. Judy and Mike show. Yeah. 
I love Boss Hog. I love them too. And you know, there were no Jews in that band, oddly enough. <laughs> Although you had to have a Jew in, a, in your band to be in New York and somewhat successful. I have no idea. <laughs> Jack, can you play uh, Judy singing again? Maybe like knock Shut it down. Shut up. Bring it down like maybe like brum, another A few octave. more semitones. Yeah, let's, let's let it rip. A few more semitones. Yeah, here we go. Echo, okay. echo, echo. I believe the children of You guys like that? That was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Judy, you sound so sexy. Shut <laughs> up. I'm telling you. Both of I'm you. I'm telling you. Embrace it. Embrace it. Okay. This is good. This is good. You, you, you sound good. America's Got Talent, and it's right here on the Mike and Judy That's Show. Right. That's right. Broadcasting live. I have to, I have to learn a new song. Heritage Radio Network at Roberto. <laughs> <laughs> on our music special. So I'm going to sound like Brandon in the next one. <laughs> Apocalypse 2.0 coming up. Yes. Coming up soon. And Jack, you're going to be our special guest, right? I can't wait. I can't wait. In the meanwhile, though, uh, Jews. <laughs> the Dictators are one of our favorite bands, and of course, uh, they're from the uh, Bronx. So, again, I thought we got Andy Queens. Was, wasn't Andy from Queens? I don't know. Well, Richard's from the Bronx, and that's okay. sort of, I think, where they got their mojo from, right? Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, they didn't show up together. They came separately at, on two different shows. In separate limousines. In se- separate limousines. <laughs> well, they were feuding at the time. I think we, they've got a kayfabe pace, piece packed yeah. in order right they now. To, they need to get it together so they can cash in on the dictators. Oh. Well, Richard's got his own band out, Manitoba. Right, with our with friend Dean. Dean the Dream Rispler, one of my favorite Jews. And um, they're I'm absolutely... feeling a little discriminated against as the atheist in the room. Oh, atheism. Anyway, so we're, he- we're going to hear from Andy Chernoff first. Get a little correct? light shine in, Judy. Atheism's too cynical. Uh-huh. Let the door open. Let the light uh-huh. shine in. The, so your so gift music. is obviously God-given. Okay, well, when you put it that way... I still don't understand the whole Whitney Houston thing. I, I don't get it. I don't. I, she never meant anything to me. All that outpouring of emotion, especially when she did up and die on Facebook amongst the you know so-called punk rock community in which I, I live. Everybody was like so upset about Whitney Houston. What the fuck did she actually mean I, to I, any of these people? She all she ever did was perfect the American Idol way of singing. All these like perfect notes and these curly cues with her voice. And at the end of the day, she's a good singer with a lot of production, and she sang great on some movie soundtrack. I don't even know what the fuck else she did, frankly. She was the late Mabel's favorite singer. Mabel was your cat, of course. Yes. That's why I sing that song so beautifully, because I am channeling the spirit of Mabel. Speaking of channeling spirits and God, I think Andy Chernoff's got a song about Jesus. Yes. That was a good day. Let's, uh, let's go back in time and to when Jews were on our show singing about Jesus. <laughs> Put on the Wayback Machine and play the song, Jack. <laughs> Well, I was born a sinner, I was naked in the womb From the time I was a fetus, I knew I was doomed Offered my forgiveness, he said he wanted more And that's how I learned to serve the Lord So get on your knees for Jesus till he comes, till he comes Get on your knees for Jesus till he comes He didn't want to leave us, so he's coming back to please us Get on your knees for Jesus till he comes When Adam ate the apple, that's when it began The sacred tree of knowledge was never meant for man I felt it when he touched me, I knew he was my friend And that's when I saw Jesus rise again So get on your knees for Jesus till he comes, till he comes Get on your knees for Jesus till he comes want to leave us, so we coming back to please us, get on your knees for Jesus till he comes, get on your knees for Jesus till he comes, get on your knees for Jesus till he comes. All right, yeah. 
Thank you, Andy Chernoff. That was beautiful. You sure we can't hear Judy just one more time? No! That's enough. <laughs> that is enough. All right, well, here's my star turn then, uh, playing guitar with um, our other favorite dictator, Handsome Dick Manitoba. On our second ever show. Our second ever show, uh, almost a year ago, and uh, Dick's been on more than once, in fact. Yeah, but only with me once, so only once counts. Oh, that's right, because you weren't around for the Meet the Manitoba show. You were mm-hmm. off touring your new book or something equally important, mm-hmm. the official book of Sex, Drugs, and Rock and Roll lists. Available at fine bookstores everywhere. It's the best book ever. Anyway, uh, this was good. Probably as close as I'll ever get to being a Ramon. I'm uh, slinging the guitar with our friend Handsome Dick Manitoba. It's Rockaway Beach. It's been the Mike and Judy Music Spectacular, a cavalcade of stars. Live from Roberto's here on the Heritage Radio Network, Judy McGuire. <laughs> Bye. A special thanks to Jack Inslee. See you guys for Apocalypse. And we'll see you soon. Chewing at a rhythm on a bubble gum. Sun is out. I want some. It's not hard, not far to reach. We can hitch a ride to Rockaway Beach. Up on the roof, out in the street. Down in the pavement, the hot concrete. Bus ride is too slow. Blast out the disco on the radio. Rock, rock, Rockaway Beach. Rock, rock, Rockaway Beach. Rock, rock, rock away beach. We can hitch a ride to rock away beach. Rock, rock, rock away beach. Rock, rock, rock away beach. Rock, rock, rock away beach. We can hitch a ride to rock away beach. Yeah! It's not hard, not far to reach. We can hitch a ride to rock away beach. It's not hard, not far to reach. We can hitch a ride to rock away beach. Ruin at the rhythm of a bubble gum. Sun is out. I want some. It's not hard, not far to reach. We can hitch a ride to rock away beach. Up on the roof, out in the street, down in the pavement, to hot concrete. Bus ride is too slow. Blast out the disco on the radio. Rock, rock, rock away beach. Rock, rock, rock away beach. Rock, rock, rock away beach. We can hitch a ride to rock. Rock away beach, rock 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 away beach, rock 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 away beach, rock 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 away beach. We can hitch a ride to rock away beach. Hey! Bop 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 bop. I like them I was doing wrong. the two thing. One two one two three four. Rock 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 away beach, rock 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 away beach, rock 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 away beach. Rock, 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 Hitch a ride to rock away beach. Rock, rock, rock away beach. Rock, rock, rock away beach. Rock, rock, rock away beach. We could hitch a ride to rock away beach. Bring it home, Sharky.